This is my first time buying a ready-to-wear from Hermes, so I cannot wait to reveal it to you guys. And of course from Matches Fashion because they're one of my favorite luxury shopping sites. Don't worry, I'll be styling everything so that you can see how it looks on my body. By the way, if you're brand new here, hello, my name is Amy and I would love to have you subscribe to my channel. I do a lot of luxury and fashion videos. All right, before I get started, I do want to show you a couple pieces from Julia. They usually come packaged like this. Shopping bag, a little catalog, and a silver polishing cloth as well. Of course, I'm already wearing one of the pieces that I received from them. This is a really, really cute personalized necklace. It is in sterling silver and gold plated. I love how super dainty and shiny it is. I am wearing it on the shortest setting. So as you can see, it has quite a bit of adjustment and I love this little charm here at the end. One of the reasons why I like their jewelry is because they're very, very cute, really well made very reasonably priced because it's sterling silver but I also love the fact that it's gold plated so that it doesn't tarnish. The second piece here is a bracelet that I chose to uh, gift for someone because it is not in my size. It's in sterling silver also plated with gold with little rhinestone details and it has a hinge so it's super convenient to put it on press and open. This is the mechanism and there's a little hinge on this side super super convenient easy to wear it is only one size and it is really really large on me yeah it goes all the way down to my wrist so it's not for myself i did choose it for a friend but as you can see it's really really cute and it would easily be stacked with other bracelets. I'll be linking the bracelet and the little necklace down below in the description box in case you're interested in checking it out and I have a little surprise for you. They have also agreed to let me host a giveaway to win one of their personalized necklaces. I'll make it super simple to enter. Just make sure you like this video and also comment down below which style that you would like to win uh, and also put your email address or your Instagram handle so that I can contact you back. That's it. Super simple. So if you're interested in winning maybe like this necklace or any of their other personalized necklaces, just um, yeah, enter. All right, let's do some Hermes unboxing, shall we? Uh, well, I have unboxed it myself already, but since you guys have never seen it, I will reveal it for the first time to you guys. Um, yeah, let me do this one first because there was one pair of shoe that I got last time that uh, didn't fit me, so I would have had to go back and exchange them, uh, which I did. So this is what I ended up with. If you haven't seen it, I'll link the playlist up here so you can check it out. Instead of that pair of shoes, I got this pair. Back to the original white one, basically. I did get a request to show my loafers on my foot uh, longer, like to basically style them in a video to show you guys more in detail. So this is what I'm going to be doing in this video because I bought a bunch of clothes anyway. So I might as well just style them at the same time to show you how these look on my feet. So I do own the Royal loafers in 37 and a half. And for the Colette, I actually had to go up to a size 38. My big toe is my longest of all toes and somehow they always rub um, if the shoe is not uh, you know the the pointiest at the most inner side of the shoe. So as you can see the Colette they're basically rounded to the middle. And I also got some ready to wear for the very first time. My essay actually invited me to the pre-fall is it pre-fall yeah i think it was the pre-fall launch so i was really really excited and uh had something in mind that i wanted to get based on the runway because it wasn't even on the website yet at the time when i went and uh they didn't have it they actually didn't really receive that many items on the day that i was uh going in to check out their uh pre-fall launch so I ended up picking up this instead, which is not even from the pre-fall collection. It's actually from the previous collection. It doesn't come with the box. I was really surprised, but apparently ready to wear just comes packaged like this and their tissues. And I got this really, really cute top from them. Isn't it gorgeous, guys? Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. So this is the Shendonk design 
which is one of my favorite patterns from Hermes. It's a t-shirt from their last collection and it has ribbed detail as well as the fabric is a cotton but it is kind of like a uh, knitted cotton. It's really really pretty. I'm super happy to finally get a little piece of ready to wear from the house and especially one that is a stunning stunning pattern like this black and white one of my favorite uh, for sizing oh my gosh i have to talk about sizing i feel like Hermes ready to wear is super small because i am usually in balmain i'm usually a 34 or a 36 and i tried this top in a 36 i couldn't get in <laughs> I think if I was more flexible, I would have been able to uh, because I do have joint problems. So even my shoulders, I can't really squeeze too tight to get into any shirt or any tops, basically. Uh, so I had to size up in order to get into this t-shirt. But I was just so surprised that um, their, their ready-to-wear is really, really small. So... Uh, that is something to keep in mind if you want to shop online. I did a pretty good spring cleaning recently and I consigned and donated a bunch of my older clothes. Just things that I just, you know, didn't like to fit anymore or I just didn't like the style anymore. So I bought a bunch of denim. <laughs> I kind of went a little cray cray. Um, I bought everything from the brand Frame Denim. Plus it was on sale and it's even more on sale now because I bought these a while ago now. Uh, so I will be linking everything down below so that if you're interested, check it out. Uh, the sizing is more and more limited now because it's even more further reduced, but check it out regardless. Uh, so one, actually two pairs of jeans that I bought or two pair of pants that I bought are these really cute, um, how would, what are these called actually? It's a really cute high-waisted crop style and um, kind of balloon style, but cropped and it's high-waisted. And I love the fit of this because it's so comfortable. It's high-waisted, so it's more modern now. I, I guess we're back to high-waisted jeans. But it's also cropped so that for shorties like me, I'm only 5'4", it actually shows a bit of ankle and um, it's just the perfect fit. I can wear boots with this, like really slender winter boots or fall boots, or I can just wear the loafers or even dad sandals with these. They're just so versatile. I love, love, love the style of these. This one is a more sort of heavy duty denim. It's just, you know, your classic denim, but same exact shape. And it's uh, yeah super cute with like a white top like today. I'm a summer baby, so I love wearing dresses. I love wearing shorts. I just love being in really lightweight clothing. And so I have added these four pairs of shorts and I kind of got rid of some of the older style, like the really kind of tight, but kind of mid waist or, you know, lower waisted ones. Um, I just went for these, which are all high waisted and just a little bit more modern. So I got this one. It's called the Vintage Bermuda. It's a really cute sort of um, body hugging, but it has more length. The other one was just slightly more classic and more of the classic denim color, whereas this one is a more washed and uh, has um, distressing on it. Two more pairs of summer shorts. These are super cute. And uh, this one has two buttons and a little pleat detail here in the middle. I love a good white denim short that fits well. Um, so anyway, I'll link it down below. This one I got in a size 24. Also got this really lightweight um, linen pair of shorts. I love that this linen is so soft and flowy. Like the drape is absolutely stunning and it's very soft. It's really good quality linen. And I got this in a size extra small. This one is a little oversized, so it will sit a bit lower than your true waist. All right, I'm gonna try on everything. Let me know what you think of my new ready to wear. What's your favorite? Okay, so this is the first look. How amazing is this, right? Oh my gosh, I love it. So uh, yeah, so this is the t-shirt. So it is a bit loosey-goosey and the shoulders are a little bit loose, but that's okay because I sized up. 
and also because I couldn't get in a 36. But I actually love the fit because, um, I, I don't know, I like it a little loose, it's not skin tight uh, and it still fits really really well. I obviously tucked it in and I threw on a belt. So these are the pants uh, from Frame Denim. I love how the pleats here just creates more of a balloon shape around my hips. It gives me a bit more hips even though I don't have them. Uh, so it just, yeah, it just gives me more shape. And I threw in some heels to dress it up. I just love this look. I'm gonna dress it down now. I'm gonna wear the loafers so that you guys can see how it looks. And it works because the t-shirt has some white in it anyway. It still kind of works even though the loafers are pretty obvious. But because the top has a bit of white, I think it's okay. I did remove the belt. And as you can see, these pants are, are a little bit big for the waist in the size 24. But it's okay. It's kind of more casual, relaxed. Uh, and I styled it with my mini. If you want it even more casual, you can just untuck it or maybe just half tuck the shirt. Doing it on the fly right now. It's kind of, you know, you can make it more casual like this. I still feel like the loafers look best when you're wearing shorts or when you're showing more legs. This is another way of dressing this t-shirt and I love the pleats on this short. It just has more of a longer length but kind of flared out and um, I love the double button detail and it's super cute. Yeah, love these shorts. <laughs> so these are the linen shorts. As you can see they sit a little lower and they're pretty casual but they're super comfortable and they're pretty cute. I love all the pocket details and the little uh, fold over here and it's super lightweight, really comfortable, matches the top really well, just tucked in, uh, super roomy so you can eat. I did wear these loafers just to show you how they look. I know they are, yeah, the, the colors are not really matching. Just pretend I had like a gold color belt, maybe it will look better or a gold color bag, which I don't own any, but I just wanted to show you that these loafers do look really nice on the foot. And um, yeah, they really, they really are surprising. They, they really are surprising and really elongating and super comfortable. But if you just wanted to elevate this casual look, just put on some heels. So matching black heels, and uh, maybe throw on that nice hardware belt and then you're good to go. Yeah, I think this kind of dresses up the whole look for an evening. Oh, I just love these jeans so much. So these are the same pants as the black one, except that this one fits, uh, I guess it fits true to size, whereas the black ones are uh, looser at the waist. But I love the shape and I love that they are crop, good for shorties like me. And I'm dressing it up with these white heels from Mark Fisher and just a white tee and my gray cocoa handle. It's just a really cool, uh, casual, chic outfit. And this is how it looks with the loafers. I think they look really good. I just love how balloon and how these pleats gives you a bit more shape to your body. This dressed Bermuda shorts in the light wash. Even though I'm sort of really casual, I can still pull off the cocoa handle. I just feel like it's such a... Oh, it's so cool. I, I just love it. These are the slouch Bermuda shorts and uh, it is in size 23 actually. I decided to not tuck in my top this time, just wear the uh, the, this was the original way. But if you did tuck it in, then these shorts would look more like sort of, um, yeah, they would look more like legging shorts or biker shorts almost, I feel. And yeah, that would be how they would look like. But otherwise, if you had more hips or legs, then you would fill these more, but I don't. So this is how it looks on me, but I, I think they still look okay. 
I think they still fit. Let me know down below which one were your favorite pieces and what you thought of the loafers and the shorts because I kind of went a little overboard even though I did get rid of a lot of stuff but I just re-added it so yeah I'm terrible with clothing I love clothing so much but yeah let me know down below which were your favorite pieces and of course don't forget to check out Julia Artisan Jewelry I have all the links down below and if you want to enter my giveaway you know what to do that's it thank you so much for watching if you're brand new to my channel I would love to have you back and especially if you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe and I'll talk to you guys again very soon bye